stem cells and uses the study of structure and function of plant and animal cells is called cytology or cell biology it brought revolutionary changes in human health and medicine one of the important area in cytology is the study of stem cells stem cells are the special kind of cells which can replicate themselves as well as can produce different kind of cells in the body this ability of stem cells to become any type of cell in the body is called pluripotency it give rise to different body organs and tissues based on source where the stem cells can be found these are of two kinds embryonic stem cells and adult stem cells embryonic stem cells the fusion of male and female gamete give rise to zygote at the earlier stage of development the organism is in the form of mass of cells all alike these are called stem cells from 14th day of fertilization a process called cell differentiation begins through this process the stem cells start getting converted into fully functioning specialized cells it is possible to obtain stem cells well before 14th day of embryonic development usually during 5th to 7th day these cells are cultured in laboratory with suitable biochemical stimulus so as to produce fully functional specialized type of cells tissues and organs adult stem cells these are the stem cells obtained from adult human body these are found in red bone marrow adipose connective tissue and blood these are also present in umbilical cord blood obtained after the birth here are the uses of stem cells regenerative therapy in case of situations like traumatic brain injury diabetes alzheimer's disease parkinson's disease myocardial infarction etc the stem cells are used to replace the dead or lost cell and repairs the tissue organ transplantation due to various reasons such as aging accidents infection and diseases etc the organs of the body become less efficient or undergo failure this situation could be life threatening one way to solve this problem is to transplant the same organ from others body these are the organs such as kidney which can be donated by an alive individual however organs like liver heart eyes can only be donated after death in case of transplantation of organs in this way there are several problems like availability of donor necessity of having a match between donor and recipient in terms of blood group diseases disorders age etc in such case it is possible to obtain stem cells from person's body and with suitable biochemical stimulus produce the required organ from them for transplantation thus organ transplantation become possible without a donor here we complete this topic for more such videos visit learnfatafat.com